Hey guys, a lot of you have uh, asked me to do a a partial disassembly of the laptop to show you how to um, fix in the new hard drive and uh, how to change the RAM, right? So it's going to make this video here. Again, before I do anything, I want to let you guys know I don't have a tripod, I don't have a phone mount, I don't have anything like that. So the video is going to be a bit shaky. I'm going to try my best to keep it stabilized to show you where you actually need to know uh like the uh the crucial points okay first of all there are 13 screws on it one two three so this factory seal if you live in the u.s or in canada you don't need to worry about it it does not um void your warranty so don't worry about it so one two three four five two over there six seven two at this side eight nine ten one in the middle eleven one over here Sorry, one over here, 12, one over here, 13. So a total of 13 screws. Four, four, sorry, four, three, three, and then one, two, and then one extra, one extra. Now, one thing I want you guys to remember is this this screw on the back is, is smallest one, just like this one. These are the smallest one, so make sure you keep them separate. Let me show you some as well here. Okay okay so look at this this one is smaller than this one so this one and there should be one more right here this baby okay so these two these two let me turn on the flash okay so these two are at the back should go at the back so make sure you know that and keep them separate okay back to the laptop let's turn off the flash again you know what on is good okay now you can't just take the hatch off like that you have to be patient and you have to be very very careful here because there's one thing you need to know this panel right here this steel thingy you gotta take it out and you can't take it out by your nail you need like a uh like you know those blue thingies the openers you need that for this if you don't have that because i don't this is what i use now a lot of people will say it's gonna scratch your laptop this and that i know i get it i've scratched my previous laptop as well please don't give me that um that lecture okay so now i'm gonna try to do it with one hand this is what you need to do you need to bring it here like this like the laptop with your heat sinks up up here now you need to let me focus you need to put this in here on the side because this whole panel um show you okay okay so this thing this is all that panel right above this leopard part so what you're gonna do is you're gonna put your straight head driver in on the side and you're gonna push it out and up and it's gonna pop out let me show you how I'm just better with the right side so okay so here it is it's already popped out okay yeah there you guys can see so as soon as it's it pops out from here this is what I do I put it in I push it up like this and that's it once it pops out you need to do this you need to move your driver or your opener all the way like this see keep on moving it okay okay don't make sure you don't push it in all the way because there's locks in there i think you guys can see the locks there as well we don't want to break those locks so just lightly and just push it just make sure you hear that like that noise of uh, the locks being opened up okay I'm opening my laptop I should clean it as well okay once that is done you just take it out it's taken out your laptop will look naked like that now what are you gonna have to do is open up your laptop and see if everything's fine first of all I want you to see that because of that thingy that we're pushing in everything should be fine it should like there's your display strip right there's your card thingy keep it closed turn it around now you can remove the hatch and to remove the hatch you need to pop it out 
now even this to pop this out make sure you don't do anything to this chip thingy you need to push it out like so and you need to do that again with your head driver you keep it there now there's a heat sink i don't want to damage that look at this look at this look at this this is what you guys gotta do now this is fucking dangerous i'm gonna do it with two hands give me a sec please okay so just like that you'll pop it out make sure you pop it out from this place you pop it out from all the way here focus here so make sure you don't touch your heat sink so do it by the plastic right there and you pop it out from here okay after popping it out it's pretty simple it's just gonna go down like that and you pull it all the way up by popping out all the locks like so okay use my right hand like that like that and keep on moving your hand to keep on opening up the let pop yes i did say let pop that's what i used to say when i was a kid okay come on come on come on you really need two hands with this I'm just doing this for you guys. I know a lot of people are going to come on here. They won't know my history. They won't know anything that I'm not a professional YouTuber. And they're going to be like, oh, this was fucking stupid. He's doing it really unprofessionally. Yeah, because I'm a fucking unprofessional, but I fix my own things. There's the Barracuda 2TB that I have installed. Focus here. These are two RAMs on the laptop. That is our precious SSD. So there's only one SSD socket that is our wi-fi card under here is our processor and under here is our gpu chip that is a desktop gpu that is our battery that is not so good you guys can see those um those fans are pretty fine and they're nice i don't think i need to clean them anyways i thought i should but yeah they're all fine so make sure nothing's damaged uh these are your speakers do not touch that i've made that mistake and nothing happens right away but if you touch them like multiple times you can fuck your speakers up make sure you keep all these um capacitors safe all the wires safe now to take now this unit has two hgb rams you guys know how to take it out like just like so and so that's it pops right out um, I don't have another RAM to install. What I would recommend is to install two 16 GBs or at least one 16 GB as well. And here's that Barracuda 2 TB. All you need to do is to, because I've already screwed it, and you should have in the box, you should have this frame panel as well. So I already screwed it. You got to screw it out. And so, I mean, you won't have it screwed here. So what you got to do is you got to take your hard drive. You got to put it in this steel panel and you got you'll like have other screws to lock the hard drive with the panel and then you can just like plug it in and then you can screw it in here that's all you need to do and after you're done with all of this make sure your laptop is clean and it's nice simplest thing you're gonna bring this up here put it up and you're gonna keep on clicking it like so to keep on locking it in place like that and you're gonna start with like so make sure this is all like look this is all gone and now this is because we don't have the screws screwed in yet so yeah okay make sure side is good make sure the front is good the other side is good after you're done with this simplest thing no need to worry about this thing you like this is just popping this out as kind of like hard popping it back in is pretty fucking easy all you need to do is align it so you guys can see here this curved part goes over the leopard thingy just like so and you just pop it back in now another way to do it and the better way to do it is to open your laptop a bit just a bit I'll tell you why right away and keep it like this this so it's easier for this part this curved part to go up and in 
flow like this keep it here slide it like so come on i think i need two hands with that again yeah i think i need two hands so sorry about this guys oh yeah okay however you'll just slide that in and i need to see now okay it's also done so we're good like so and look at this look at this baby it's still not going in okay so you gotta screw that now once we're done with that i would suggest you start with the top screws the topest one the shortest screws that are these where's my screwdriver okay Okay, so as I was saying, this is what I recommend. Start with these two. After they are done, go with these two, of course. Now, go as random. But what I would still say is to pop this one in first. So your chassis and your panel D is sitting in perfectly. And then you can go with the corner ones again and then just wrap it up. Now give me one sec. I'm going to wrap it up. I'm going to come back right here. Okay, after you're done with all of these... Uh, screws in there make sure you put your where is my uh, screwdriver so okay here it is make sure you put all of your screwdrivers and everything back in place safely and you wrap your boxes up here we go and our laptop should be all good to go and there should be nothing that seems out of place and look i haven't even scratched it see if you do it nicely you won't even scratch it you will not have anything to worry about everything will be fine as hell open up your laptop turn it on to see everything is good there we go msi we are good to go take care guys